This is Streamline News for Thursday, July 12, 2012, brought to you by SwimOutlet.com, the web's most popular swim shop. The U.S. Olympic swim team held a public workout session for fans this morning in Knoxville, Tennessee, and the Allen Jones Aquatic Center was packed with fans waiting for the opportunity to get an autograph from one of their favorite swimming stars. Today is also an official media day for the swimmers as they talk to various members of the media about their preparations for London. Swimming World will bring you interviews with some of the Olympians on upcoming episodes of the Morning Swim Show. At that training camp, the team selected five captains, Natalie Coughlin, Brendan Hansen, Jason Lezak, Rebecca Sony, and Peter Vanderkay. All five bring immense international experience to the team and beyond their leadership, will be looked to for Olympic medals in a few events. Jessica Long won the ESPY Award for Best Female Athlete with a Disability last night at the ceremony in Los Angeles. Long has had an amazing year so far, breaking several world records at the U.S. Paralympic Trials last month. Look for her to continue her winning streak in August at the Paralympics. Caitlin Leverance was also in the running for an ESPY, but lost the Best Female College Athlete Award to Baylor basketball player Brittany Griner. France and China recently made some Olympic announcements regarding their rosters, with France's Armory Laveau scratched from the 200 free being of the biggest news. Laveau said he had conversations with his coach about the 200 free and believing he could not post a time that would win him an, an Olympic medal, decided to put his sole focus on the 400 free relay. China officially put Lu Zhiga on the Olympic squad in the 200 fly over Gong Ji, who finished second in the event at the Olympic trials. Lu Zhiga was well off form at the trials, placing third. China has not released a statement over putting Lu on the team, but it's likely she was put on the team because she's the reigning Olympic champion in the 200 fly and won bronze in the event last summer at the World Championships. That will do it for Streamline News today. Thanks for watching.